Do you need to gain some momentum on starch solution? Do you need to get into a routine? How do you know that this lifestyle has clicked? Hey friends, Liz here with Full and Fulfilled. I am so excited you are tuning in today because I get a lot of questions about when does this lifestyle click on? And I wanna to talk to you about that a little bit, about gaining momentum and what that looks like. I didn't always think food was fuel. I knew that I wanted to get to a place where that was the case but I had to like go through it. I had to start really understanding Start Solution more and more. I had to create the consistency and keeping food simple. I had to get into a routine. I had to plan out my meals for the week. I had to do my three Ps. If you don't know about my three Ps, I'm gonna link below my series on planning prepping and preparing. Learn about the three Ps. They were a game changer for me. And so I created this whole method about how to set yourself up for a successful week on Start Solution. Part of gaining momentum is having a routine, stacking habits, thinking about what that end goal looks like and how you're going to get there. You also have to know how much food you need to keep you full and satisfied until your next meal so that you're not hungry or walking to the pantry or the lounge at work and grabbing snacky food. We need to fill our bellies with starches and vegetables that will keep us full until our next meal. You got to sauce it up. You have to find sauces that you enjoy to put over your starches or your vegetables. And it really makes a difference when you can add a little bit of flavor to those starches and vegetables. I've gotten to a point where I don't have a ton of sauces anymore because I love the flavor of vegetables. Steamed cabbage is so good. I literally crave that the most. I crave steamed cabbage. You have to know your go-to items. What are those starches and those vegetables and those fruits that you love? What are the sauces you love? And better yet, how do you like them prepared? Meaning, how do you like them cooked? Do you like them steamed? Do you like them roasted? Do you like them sauteed? How do you like to prepare your starches and vegetables? That is key in gaining momentum, is finding out what are those methods. Do you like things in the Instant Pot? Do you like things more in soup? Do you want your potatoes roasted? Or do you want them baked? Do you want them air frayed? Do you like them crispy? Do you like them soft? There's so many dynamics around how you can make a potato. You can make it in so many ways. So how do you like to enjoy it? That's what you need to find out. I knew I started gaining momentum when I couldn't wait to get out for my daily walk. I was enjoying my activity level and I started thriving in that element. I found a podcast, I found an audiobook. I was chatting with a friend. Any way that I could get myself out for at least an hour a day and walk, create movement, and get my 10,000 steps in or more. I say all of this because this was a method that I started realizing the more I started finding food as fuel. All of these tips that I have shared with you in this video, I have really thought about. I have pondered 
why I'm now in such a better place around starch solution and why I just love veggies and starches so much. And I've gotten to a point where I have that momentum and I've had it for a while, ever since my Breaking My Plateau series. If you haven't checked that out, check the full 16 weeks out. I lost an additional 18 pounds in addition to my original 35 pounds. So I'm at a total of 48 plus pounds that I've lost over the past few years. And this last 18 pounds that I lost really empowered me, but it empowered me because I had momentum. I just set my eye on the prize. I kept my meals simple and consistent over and over, day after day. I picked my starches I was gonna eat every week. I picked my vegetables. I rarely snacked because I knew how much food, or I should say I discovered how much food I needed to keep me full and satisfied until my next meal. I put in the work and I now have the results. And now I'm at just a better place all around starch solution, around food, how to fuel my body, and I feel really empowered. And I hope that this video provides some inspiration to dedicate your days to building a better lifestyle around Start Solution. Thank you for being here. Thanks for being a part of my journey. I have had so much fun documenting this whole process with you all. It's also kept me really accountable to myself and I kept my eye on the prize and I worked with a coach and I really pushed through and I changed, I shifted, I evolved as a human. I'm such a stronger person because I gave myself my three months dedicated to myself. I focused on food. I knew how to build my dish with my starches and vegetables. I made myself go out every single day to create steps to get my activity in. You are the only one that can do this for yourself. And I hope you get to a place where you have momentum all around Start Solution. Thanks for being here in my journey. It means so much to me. Thanks for tuning into today's video. I appreciate you being here. And I hope that you are in a place in your journey that you want that momentum. You want to see that shift and that change because if you do go all in and give yourself that, you will get that momentum and really focus food as fuel.